Meanwhile, strong words and sharp allegations late this morning directed by former Memphis Mayor Willie Harrington at certain city and Shelby County leaders. Harrington contends that a term limit ordinance on the November ballot would intentionally and personally block him from his planned run for mayor in 2019. Local 24 News reporter Brad Broders is live in downtown Memphis this morning where a news conference just wrapped up. Brad. Good morning, Caitlin. Well, Willie Harrington contends that a person or group of people illegally changed that specific question on the ballot, which he says would specifically stop him from running for a fifth mayoral term. Now, Harrington said just a short while ago, the original ballot question approved by the Memphis City Council in January would have set a three consecutive term limit for anyone who served at any time after December 31st, 2011. Harrington announced his 2019 mayoral candidacy in April. In August, Harrington claims the ordinance questions was changed from that 2011 time frame to a broader at any time. He said that unapproved questions sent to the Shelby County Commission is now on the November ballot. Because Harrington is the only person who served four mayoral terms, he contends the ballot question change is specifically against him. No conspiracy, no devious behavior among high-level governmental officials in the city government and the Shelby County Election Commission is going to deprive the citizens of the right to vote for me. Now, right now, my colleague Mike Matthews is gathering a response from city leaders. He'll have a recap of this entire story on both sides starting at 5. Reporting live in downtown Memphis, Brad Broders, Local 24 News.